Hello, I wanted to do a video on how we're repairing a 90 horsepower Yamaha two cycle outboard that keeps overheating at higher RPMs. I've done a previous video on this motor on how we flushed it using this hammerhead descaler. You can refer to that. That helped a little bit, but the engine would still overheat at higher RPMs. So what we did was take this uh, head cover off. There's a whole bunch of 10 millimeter bolts. They're not on there very tight. If you can see, the torque is 0.8 uh, kilogram grams. Um, and uh, they're kilograms per meter actually torque. Um, so they're, they come up very easily. You first take off the thermostat, which belongs up here. And then we use a screwdriver and a wire brush and a little pick to clean out all the deposits in these tubes. Now this is not, this part here is the cylinder head. So we just took the head cover off and cleaned all this out. Um, I would not recommend sandblasting it because you don't really want to get any um, sand down in the water jacket. Um, so we just scraped it all off, did the same to the inside of the cover. And now we're just getting ready to put it back together. Um, I bought a new gasket, new thermostat. Uh, there's what they call pressure relief valve in there, replaced that. Uh, total was about $80 in parts. I bought them online. So we're gonna put it back together. I've done this on a, a different 90 horsepower Yamaha and that fixed the overheating problem. Just for reference, this is the um, temperature sensor right here in the, in the cylinder head. So at higher RPMs, the alarm would go off. Uh, over here is where you flush the engine. The flushing port goes into here. I would not recommend that you do anything with this. Um, these bolts are immersed in the water jacket and I guarantee you, if you try to take them off an old motor, you're gonna break bolts. Uh, but like I said, these in the, on this part are very, they're not very tight. They came off very easily and uh, this should fix the overheating problem.